The exorcism of Annalise Michelle, a real-life possession, delves into one of the most harrowing and controversial cases of purported demonic possession in modern history. Annalise Michelle, a young German woman, endured a series of terrifying events that captured global attention in the 1970s. The story begins in 1968, when Annalise, a deeply religious girl from a devout Catholic family, started experiencing seizures and exhibiting strange behaviors. Medical professionals diagnosed her with epilepsy and later psychosis, attributing her symptoms to mental illness. However, conventional treatments failed to alleviate her condition. As Annalise's condition worsened, she and her family became convinced that she was possessed by demons. Seeking spiritual intervention, they turned to Catholic priests for help. Over the course of several years, Annalise underwent numerous exorcism sessions, during which she displayed extraordinary strength and spoke in multiple voices including those of historical figures and even in languages she had never learned. The exorcisms, conducted with the approval of the Catholic Church, were intensely grueling and physically demanding, lasting for hours at a time. Annalise's health deteriorated rapidly during this period, and she refused to eat, believing that her suffering would help atone for the sins of others. Tragically, Annalise Michelle died in 1976 at the age of 23, weighing only 68 pounds. Her death sparked a sensational trial in which her parents and the priests involved in the exorcisms were charged with negligent homicide. The case raised profound questions about faith, mental illness, and the boundaries between religion and medicine. Despite the skepticism and controversy surrounding the case, many believers regard Annalise Michael as a modern-day martyr and a testament to the reality of spiritual warfare. The story of her possession continues to fascinate and horrify people around the world, serving as a chilling reminder of the mysteries that lie beyond the realm of scientific understanding.